Hi, my name is Neil Shelton from Neil's Music, and I want to give you a comparison of the various Dean Soltero USA models. Uh, the one I'm holding in my hand is serial number one, and about the first 25 or 30 guitars, they actually made them with solid wood, then after that they went to a chambered body. This guitar has uh, custom wound DiMarzio pickups. Uh, the bridge pickup being a little hotter than the neck pickup. The neck pickup probably similar to like a vintage Gibson PAF. Uh, anyhow, check it out. Uh, this is the clean channel on the treble position. And then here's like the neck pickup. Nice, nice warm tone. playing through the Randall uh, RM100 amplifier. It's a tube amp uh, with the uh, Randall modules. Uh, right now we're on the clean module. I also have the plexi module and the grail, which is uh, similar to uh, the George Lynch uh, tone. It's a real high output, high gain, you know, heavy metal 80s tone. Plexi module gives you that nice vintage classic Marshall tone. Think of like ACDC and then uh, Ultra Clean. So check out the... That's like the nice clean tone. Here we are with the Plexi. Nice ACDC tone. Nice high gain metal tone. And then you'll notice with this uh, solid body guitar, it's a little more compressed sounding. The solid body uh, Dean Soltero guitar. Let's check out uh, the little later model Dean Soltero where they went to doing a chambered body. Uh, both guitars are mahogany body with maple tops. We'll start out with the clean channel. And we're on the treble pickup. Nice warm tone. Then here's like the neck pickup. Nice chime. Warm full body with good chime. some gain on the plexi channel. Then here we are with the real high gain channel. Okay, now let's check out the guitar that I had custom built by Dean. Um, I really like the idea of the Karina Wood. To me, the Karina Wood gives you a very uh, woodsy vintage tone. So I had Dean Guitars make eight of these for me. 
uh, Karina body with flame maple top. Uh, these are also chambered. Uh, all the ones I had made were all between eight to about eight and a half pounds, nothing over nine pounds, very lightweight, nice guitar. But they get this, uh, this very nice, like woodsy, almost vintage, 59 Les Paul kind of tone. Let's start on the Queen channel. You notice right off the bat it's a little brighter than the other guitars, not as compressed, more wide open. Which by the way, I had them put in Seymour Duncan 59 pickups. Because uh, they're very similar to an original 59 Les Paul pickup. I wanted to go for that vintage sound. And I really like the idea of having the amp do the work, you know, as far as gain and all of that. You get a mu uh, with the, the lower output, cleaner sounding pickups, you're getting more of the tone from the wood of the body. And we'll check out the, uh, well, let's check out the neck pickup. Check out the Plexi channel, which uh, is a, again is very similar to a vintage uh, Marshall tone. pickup here's with a neck pickup <laughs> check out. Uh, Dean decided to do a more reasonably priced model, so they went with an all mahogany uh, Dean Soltero. This is solid mahogany. This thing weighs a ton. It weighs almost 13 pounds. Uh, the first two uh, Dean Solteros uh, mahogany ones that they made, they made with solid wood, then they went to a chambered body, and this is actually the first one that they made. But being solid mahogany, it gives you a really thick tone. Uh, here we are on the clean channel. Here's the uh, bridge pickup. <laughs> instrument being all mahogany like this uh, we can check it out on the plexi channel you can hear the thick chunk and then of course the killer high gain <laughs> This one really has 
has some good harmonics, some real good score. <laughs> By the way, this guitar also features an ebony fretboard with uh, Mother of Pearl blocking.